Welcome back guys to the Minecraft Military Force, I'm Cretty Fox, and today we'll be taking a look at some military missiles. So I have a couple designs here. There's three main ones, the Storm Shadow, also known as the Scalp EG for French. Then we have the American uh, Attack Imps, and then we have the Russian Kinzals. These are quite small builds, so I want to group them all into one video, and I thought what it would look like in Minecraft. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and check out the Storm Shadow first. So this is a French and British long-range air launch cruise missile. In France, it's called the Scalp EG, and it's developed by Matra and British Aerospace. It's manufactured by MBDA in service since 2003, and its launch platform is used by the Tornado, the Eurofighter Typhoon, the Mirage 2000, Rafa, Gripen, and quite recently the Sukhoi Su-24. This is the bomber used by Ukraine, so I equipped it with some storm shadows here. And it's recently been reported that they attacked targets in Crimea, like the submarine, the headquarters of the Russian Black Sea fleet in Sevastopol. So it's quite a powerful weapon, and um, yeah, this is just my Sukhoi Su-24 from the Ukrainian Hell March video. Here's how it looks like underneath. And then next up, we have the MGM-140 Attack Ims, a tactical ballistic missile manufactured by Lockheed Martin. And it's launched from the HIMARS and the M270 MLRS. They actually can fit one of these things in six of the regular missile slots. And they actually use the same covers. So the enemy can't really tell just from the outside what is exactly the ammo. It does have a max range of 300 kilometers, much higher than the regular MLRS. And these have entered service in 1991, so they're not exactly new. They've been here for a while, and the U.S. has just approved them to give them to Ukraine. That changes things quite a bit. I have three different designs here. I just changed the color. I don't know if this is like which one is exactly the one used. There is all sorts of color schemes for these attack -ims. And we just have these fins here in the back. And um, yeah, just red, black, and, and white. And then the back part's sort of like this yellow tannish color. And then right over here, this is the KH-47M2 Kinzel dagger in Russian, native reporting name, AS-24 Killjoy. And its launch platforms are the TU-22M3 bomber and the MiG-31K interceptor, which we have neither of in the arsenal, so I don't know, you just flies by itself, but it's touted as a hypersonic air launch ballistic missile, and it entered service quite recently in 2017. And these have been used to attack Kyiv and other Ukrainian cities, along with the Shahed Kamikaze drones. They are hyped up as the Russians, being hypersonic and no one can intercept it until the Patriot Defense Missile System intercepted some of these. So yeah, it's not unstoppable. And I just have it in two colors, white and this light gray, and I sort of just have to use snow for this one. So probably the white one looks more uniform because it's all snow. That, that is pretty much it for all the missiles here. Now, if you guys do want to build this, here's what it looks like in vanilla without any shaders. You'll see uh, this part here with the cyan terracotta that's six blocks long. And you should be able to build this. It's pretty self-explanatory. And again, this is the one in transport mode. It folded up the wings on the top part. And for the attack ends, here's how that looks like. This is a really simple design. It should only take you like maybe a couple minutes or less, probably less if you have all the materials. Here's the other attack M's design. And then here is the Kinzel. You'll see right over here, this is going to be two layers and three layers tall. Snow here and three layers here in the back. Some signs on the side and these are just slabs by the way. Just cover that up. Skeleton skulls for the fins and iron trap doors in the back, carpet on top. And um, this is just the light gray version if you guys do want to have that one. And a special treat for all you guys who are still watching this video. Let me give you a preview of an upcoming uh, video that I'm doing. This is actually commissioned by Owen Brost. I was asking him to uh, commission a runway because I really feel we need more military based tutorials. So here's a preview of this air base that I'm doing. Um, and the one over here, this one's actually Russian. So stay tuned for that and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.